The Experience Pros Radio Show, home of the original Fan Bragging Fridays. Take just 20 seconds to become a revolutionary by sharing a fan bragging story of great customer service on Facebook.com slash Experience Pros. Now, back to Angel and Eric, the Experience Pros. Does telling your story so it gets heard, understood, and remembered sometimes feel like Mission Impossible? Well, you need to know our next guest. Our next guest is Jerry Brown with JerryBrownPR.com. He's here on the Experience Pros Radio Show every week at this same time. So make sure you tune in to find out how you can take your storytelling to the next level. Jerry, welcome. Thank you. It's good to be here. Well, we're thrilled to have you. What's our storytelling tip for this week? Well, today's tip is to use what I call the big four to tell your story. It's four ways you can tell your story to increase your chances of getting the rest of us to care. To care. Yeah. And, um, you know, in recent weeks, we've talked a lot about writing tips and grammar and things like this. This one is really about content. Um, And number one on that big four is solve a problem or create an opportunity which are really flip sides of the same thing. And an awful lot of selling is about this. You know, there's an old adage, I haven't heard it in years, so maybe it's dated, but if you build a better mousetrap, uh, you know, people will beat a path to your door. I guess right. now it's if you beat a, if you build a better smartphone, they'll uh, <laughs> beat a path to your and store. And they have. Yes, they have. Um, uh, so, it, you know, if you have a, an opportunity to offer or a problem to solve that affects a lot of people, then a lot of people are going to be interested in your story because it affects them. And everybody's favorite subject, of course, is me. Uh, number two is to provide useful useful information or tips, uh, you know, five ways to uh, lose weight, how to conduct your business on, or how to conduct business on the golf course. If, if you look at newspapers, you'll see lots of tip stories. I've seen right. stories about how to buy running shoes, all kinds of things. Sure. So provide tips. That is also a good way to uh, establish your expertise. I find those are the stories that I, I click on the Internet the most, are the how-tos absolutely. and the, and the, and the, and the, the numbers. numbers. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. In fact, I was writing a, manual, a media relations manual once, and I was coming up with all these clever titles, and somebody was an old salt editor said, you know, how-to is, is the key to getting yeah. people to read it. Absolutely. Yeah. So number three is to identify a trend, uh, and more specifically, tell us how the trend either affects us or, in better yet, tell us how we can either take advantage of the trend or avoid being harmed by that trend. There was a f- former business editor and, and city editor for the Denver Post who once, I, he and I were on a panel together once, and he said only half jokingly to the audience, he said, you know, we love trend stories, and we consider anything with three plot points to be a trend. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And then now finally... Go find a story with three plot points. Exactly. Right. And finally, number four on the big four is to help the community. This is one that fits a lot of charity events, things like Dolls for Daughters that you and I are both involved in. Absolutely. Had a golf tournament last Friday, raised $18,000. That's amazing. For needy kids for Christmas toys. You know, I love working with Jerry Brown, and he gives us storytelling tips here every week of how you can right. write your story because he says the easiest thing for people to do is stop reading, but we call him King Midas. Oh, everything because he touches. turns to gold, and you take the relationships, the people that he, he knows whose desk to put your story in front of. He knows the best place to to place your story. So make sure you get in touch with Jerry Brown with Jerry Brown PR. Absolutely. Jerry, thank you so much for giving us the big four. Let's review them real quick real quick again. Absolutely. Solve a problem, create an opportunity is number one. Provide useful information or tips is number two. Identify a trend is number three and help the community. I love it. All right. You folks can reach Jerry at Jerry Brown or Jerry at JerryBrownPR.com. That's JerryBrownPR.com. Call him at 303-594-8016. 303-594-8016. That was fabulous. And that, I, I learn something from Jerry every day. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. And I think that I love that he comes and gives those tips away for free. You can go to his his website and read his blog. He's got a great um, article in writing press releases. I mean, he is the expert absolutely. and the go-to guy. But again, when you talk about what can you be doing with your time, one of those things is hiring a professional. And, and that Jerry goes... Jerry is that. We'll be right back with Angel and Eric on the most positive business talk show in America. The Experience Pros are here to help you get your business right. To learn more, visit experiencepros.com. 